Hello and welcome to Scientifically Speaking on Patreon. Uh, today we're going to be talking about uh, gravitational lensing um, due to a video that was just shown by uh, NASA of uh, an orbiting spacecraft and a view of the moon. But first, let's see what Wikipedia has to say about gravitational lens. A gravitational lens is a distribution of matter such as a cluster of galaxies between a distant light source and an observer that is capable of bending the light from the source as the light travels towards the observer. This effect is known as gravitational lensing and the amount of bending is one of the predictions of Albert Einstein's general theory of relativity. So this is saying that the gravity bends light. So that's all well and good, but it's just a theory. So let's take a look at the video and see whether or not gravitational lensing could actually be just a refraction from a medium. So this is what gravitational lensing is uh, supposed to look like. Now this obviously isn't a photo, this is digital information turned into this picture by a computer algorithm that takes the data and makes this picture. So this is not an eye person's view of what we are looking at. This is more supposed gravitational lensing. Could it be something else? Could it be a medium that is making it refract? You see, there's a reason um, why this picture of the universe looks like it is. This is all light that we can't see. This is all light that is invisible light that is picked up by machines and the data is turned into pictures. So the universe is actually amazingly full of light. We just don't have the eyes to be able to see it. We have the dullest eyes in the universe. So if the universe is filled with light and matter, which is what science is now discovering, that there is a sea of dust up there, plasma, the whole universe. So to say something is a gravitational lens when you're looking at the picture in front of you and realise the gravitation of the mass that is there, but then realise that it's not gravitational lensing, it's actually lensing on smaller things. So everything behind this should be now lensing and lensing and continuously lensing the further we get away because of the matter in between us and the actual object. So, what am I about to show you that you haven't seen before? Well, you might have seen it, and if you haven't, um, I'm showing it to you now. Uh, this is a picture of a moon setting, our moon, behind the Earth, and it, uh, it's been filmed by somebody on some spacecraft from NASA. That's about as much as I can tell you. Uh, but here we go. Here is um, refraction of a medium instead of gravitational lensing. So the guy's taking the video from some spacecraft. This was in the mail. And look what's happening to the moon. Who thinks that's gravitational lensing? Or who thinks gravitational lensing is actually refraction by a medium? In this case, an atmosphere. So all these suns have atmospheres. We have an atmosphere within the sun's actual sphere. Not the sun, but the field that the sun puts out. We are in it. Thanks very much. My name is Lee. I follow the Christ. And I'm trying to show you that the science you've been taught is nonsense. Most of it. Theory that they only confirm when they look 50 billion years into space. <laughs> Which is pretty ludicrous, really. And after watching that video, that immediately told me that gravitational lensing was nonsense. Each to his own, eh? Thanks a lot. Bye.